Roberts. I'm Janet Dugdale. I'm Chair of the Board of Trustees for the Land Trust. I've been a trustee for seven years now and I've been chair for the last 12 months. The Land Trust was formed when, um, in 2004 when the government realised its policies and plans for dealing with industrial land, uh, derelict land, wasn't working and it was looking for new ways of doing this. So the Land Trust was created to look for value-added ways of um, using green space for communities, um, for charitable benefit, for education and health and community cohesion, as well as enhancing the natural environment. The Future Scoping Report, um, its purpose and intention is to enable the Land Trust to move forward over the next 20 years, proactively thinking about how it as a charity can optimise its charitable aims of enhancing um, environment, community cohesion, health, education and economy. We need to do this by understanding what the future holds in those areas. And so we brought together a range of experts to look collaboratively and collectively at their views on what the future might hold. Collaboration is key to, to getting benefits for society, understanding the complex, wicked problems we're dealing with in social inequity, health issues and the climate crisis and using multiple stakeholders and multiple friends and partners to take this forward agenda together is absolutely vital. We can't do it on our own, we need to do it with everybody involved. The um, Future Scoping Report is fundamental as a framework for our long-term strategy. Um, it's really going to help and set the agenda for our aims and objectives as an organisation over the next 20 years. We couldn't have done it without the help of partners and collaborators and we hope it will set the framework for a joint endeavour towards social change and maximising the use of green space for social benefit.